He was talking about the first time he met Bob and Dobby, and he was saying it was probably in 1972 or three. And Bob and Dobby comes walking across the highway up his driveway and says, well, We're doing a Sauvignon, and he had this high voice, we're doing a Sauvignon tasting over at our winery, and, uh, Sauvignon Blanc tasting, and we, uh, we need a bottle of wine to put in the tasting. So I get a couple bottles. Then they started to do what you used to do, and you'd start tasting the wine. So you taste all eight wines, you make notes, and then at the end, you say, just, which ones do you like the best? The number one wine in the tasting was the cake bread seven year ball. So Bob did a cake bread bottle. He said, this is the wine we should all be making here in Napa Valley. That was his phrase. And yeah, it was like, you encourage people to make really, really good wine. And everybody's going to make money. Everybody's going to sell wine. And never to say, I am the only person that makes great wine in Napa Valley. It was always about all of us making good wine. There's been no one since that really can speak to the whole valley. That's why Bob was kind of a cool and interesting dude because he had that ability. It's like all the things that we love about old Napa wine. It's a cool wine. It's very 